Hey everyone, I has a box here, and in this box I definitely expect to find Lego stuffs because this is from Lego. This should be a bricks and pieces order that I placed not too long ago. This one came more quickly than my last two bricks and pieces orders. And as usual, I need to check, see if there's any paperwork here before I show it on camera. Nothing yet, packing material. Packing material, packing material. And there's a piece of paper. Let's take that out. Okay, cool. In this box, I have so much roller coaster track because they were selling these really cheap. Like, if you look on Bricklink, look at the prices of these. Uh, divide by three. That's about <laughs> the prices from from Bricks and Pieces, because a lot of Bricklink sellers just buy from Lego Bricks and Pieces, and then they resell. I don't think you're supposed to do that, but uh, yeah, I don't know. It's not my problem. Uh, yeah, so I got lots of curves, just regular curves, regular straights, and half straights. I also got another stack of these flexible zip line pieces. Um, as, as always, I don't remember the, the number. Wait a minute. From this here, this is something I'm not able to usually do, but for folks who are interested, there we go. So you can get your, your part numbers if you're interested in any of those. I'll try to remember to do that to actually show the part numbers if I have them available. Usually I don't, but in this case, it's very convenient. So there you go. Just pause on that. I also got some of these tall wither skeleton legs, a bunch of them, because they're unique pieces and they allow you to hold something bar shaped uh, high up. And then also some printed taco pieces from, I think one or two friend sets in particular had those little quarter round one by one tiles representing tacos. Good to get food pieces. Some more coffee mugs for my Octan company in my city to produce. And that's just that. From looking at this, would you guess that I am interested in making something <laughs> with roller coaster tracks? I think you probably could guess that. However, I don't have any secret project in mind. I'm not holding anything back from you guys. I just find these to be such useful pieces, such interesting pieces. At the very least, they look cool when just placed. I mean, they just create that interesting texture. Uh, and they they also have bar sized, uh, bar shaped tops. Uh, it's kind of off at an angle, but you can clip some things onto there. But more importantly, you can also clip things onto each of these bars. These are proper bars, so you can clip. Like for instance, you could clip. Did I just? Oh, I, I just disappeared. This. You can clip these onto these. So that can help you to create some interesting shapes. That's honestly the main reason that I got a whole bunch of these, especially with the curves, is to use them as and kind of the way that a lot of people for a long time have used just regular plastic track, the six wide track, as, as a basis for creating a curve, an official large curve without bending pieces or without partially separating pieces, you know, fully legal building techniques. Probably should have got more of the straights I don't know, because they can be used also in a vertical or horizontal orientation, you know, to create some interesting things. Could use them in my planetary defense force base. I already have a bunch of these that I got from uh, from a Bricklink seller, but I got a bunch more since, again, they're like a third of the price, a half at worst. And that's just that. So, i right, get back to work, work on another video, and talk to you again soon.